That's I'm getting into them like no other. They can keep their flowers and their debris. Hello, it's Jeffrey with Real Nifty Vintage, and today Barb and I are here at the Marine Flea Market in Marine, Illinois. And it's one of my favorite places to come because they have a revolving selection of vintage items every week. Although we don't come every week because it doesn't revolve, evolve, revolve, evolve that much. Uh, but about every two weeks, you know, it's pretty good to come through here. So I'm excited. Let's go. Oh, they've got little figurines over here. Some of these, I think, have been here for a while. I'd say most. Yeah. Unfortunately, but Unfortunately. you never know when will creep in there. You never quite know, do you? So, I actually have a bad habit of looking past all of these tools every single well, week. what would we do with them? With a monkey wrench. Yeah, I think that's what this is called. I would, I don't know. We could hang this from a Christmas tree. This one would be better, it's more red. Yeah, you could hang this. <laughs> from your nose. <laughs> That's something Aaron would say. <laughs> uh, well, yeah. I mean, there's some pretty saws, but I can't imagine selling those online. Oh, yeah. Shipping that in the mail. I had to put hazardous on there. Hazardous to your fingers. <laughs> Little cutters and things. So this is fun. We're just looking at things we don't get to see usually here. But they do. They have a good selection of, like, chains. If, you, if you're looking for a chain or a what do you do with that i think that's oh, a saw saw no it's it's a what do they call that saw jigsaw oh it's a jigsaw now these are great for christmas you put that on your table for three dollars that's cheap put that on your dining room table and you could fill it with like a whole bunch of christmas trees the bottle brush I suppose, yeah. And actually it has a nice little tier up here that you could put maybe some miniatures in the back to create or something. Look, there's lots of good That's ideas good idea. with that. But shipping that would be sort of annoying, wouldn't it? Yeah. It's kind of big. Too bad this one's not in better Ooh, shape. You've had a rough life. This one's nice too. Yeah. Let's see. I'm being all kinds of, what's the word? Adventurous today, trying to figure out what's in this box. I can't open it. If it's empty, I'm going to be a little upset. I think it's empty. I'm I upset. I don't know. It's empty. This is like a bronze thing for twenty dollars. They say brass. I think it's bronze. Hmm. I don't know. Metal's not my marble. Oh, there's my big naked doll. Oh, Barb's doll. There you go. <laughs> and here's some. Are these baby toys? They look like it. There's a baby blanket. No. Oh. Sleeper? Something. And then like these little things. Is that a... Like you roll it on your back or something? Oh, I didn't think I about don't know. that. I guess so. I didn't know what it was. It gets your wrinkles out of your clothes. Isn't she fun? Isn't he fun? <laughs> <laughs> what is he doing? Okay. I have a thing right now all of a sudden for the dolls. I see that. Does the eyes open and close? Do they? No, they do. You just gotta How really... How do you do it? You there poke you his it. eye out. No, you don't. Oh, you just you do lay that. it down. It's got an open mouth. As opposed to... I don't know. That's. Do you ever see a no. doll where you can look in its mouth? You could shove baby <laughs> food in there and it'll go moldy in its mouth. Hmm. I'm gonna carry it around. Okay. What are these supposed to be? Um, is it like a flower? No. I don't know, but it's like crafted in some fashion. There is a box of balls. Yep. All types. Ooh, that's a pair of pillowcases for $2. I will buy those. That's a good one. You're a good one. These are 50-50 blend. Oh, they're Two, oh, two standard, good. I thought they were twin at first. Two standard. So far, I bought some pillowcases. Luxury line checker set. What does a luxury checker set look like? Well, it looks like particle board and plastic. Ch 
checkers. That's luxury for you. There's that leopard box. Oh, you saw that on the <laughs> Facebook, did you? I was just saying because you were looking for a wood box now. Oh, not that, that one. one. <laughs> Here's a covered duck. It's plastic. It's a dog for somebody who can't have a real one. <laughs> who can't have a real one. Who has to have a fake one. Oh, I love these. Now, so you get both of them for $4 and they've got the feather. So they're the feather arts. Oh, that, it's like a toy box. Yeah. I like that. I like it. That's good. How much is, oh, it's $50? That's not, it's really not bad for this handcrafted thing. Well, here's a cool poodle lamp. There's actually two of them. But, see that one has a crack in its butt. Well, it's another crack, see, right there. And then this one does not, they're heavy, they're chalkware. I think I'm just gonna get the one. Actually, the front legs on that one, the front little feet have been broken off oh, too. Okay. So I feel less bad about it now. So this one looks like it's in pretty decent shape. It's $10. It's heavy, it's like I said, chalkware or plaster. Oh no, this foot has been broken too. Just the one on the left. Well, that's not too bad, but it's up to you if you think it's worth dealing with the shipping. I know, it's like, it's heavy. It's heavy, it has a little big light thingy. It's, you know, it's what we think from the 40s probably. I just don't know what to think about such a little, do oh look, I just, see. He's chipped on the front there. Are I just, both feet chipped up on both of them? Huh. Well, he's missing part of his paw, mm -hmm. like literally, so that's a problem. But this is cute. It's a raccoon chalkware. Wall hack, wall hack, wall black. <laughs> you could hang it just like that. The raccoon's cute. Does that say something? Oh, it says Mount Peace Carden, USA, Canada. Oh, like a souvenir -ish. Oh, yeah. Well, I'll get that. I'll add it to my little stack of things. This is a plaid flannel blanket for $4. It zips and stuff. Okay. This is the dollar section. One of my favorite areas because, I don't know, you just always feel like you're getting a deal. Oh, now here's like a little juice carafe. I will right, get the juice carafe. You see, for a dollar, that's not bad. This would sell for about 10 to 12. So I'll do that. And then there's actually, well, um, I don't, oh. <laughs> I was gonna say, I, I like this one, but eh, I'm not going to. So I'm out of hands. Let's see, I'll put that there. I'll put this here. We've got it, we've got it going on now. Okay. So these are all items that are a dollar each. Like curling irons and flip flops. A dollar each. Here's some state plates. Yellowstone and Mount Rushmore. Some painted, oh, the Cardinals, yes. I'm very selective with my painted plates. I have to be. Hmm. There's a this, big swan. This little strawberry pot. <laughs> so Sarah, I'm gonna say, her name is Sarah. I'm just making that up. There's a lot of Sarah things here. I saw them last week. She painted all of them. Oh, did she? How mm -hmm. smart of her. This you can hang up on your, because it has the hole, so you can hang that. I like oh, that piece for a dollar. So I'll get Sarah's thing. Is her name Sarah? I wish it was. I thought it was. Let me see if I see it on one of these others. No, oh, it's just that's a Smith. I thought it was a Sarah, but maybe not. What is this one? This tray made in China. That's not one of her. Sarah do that? No. Jim, mm, Jim. Jim did that one. Jim. Jim. Did Sarah do this one? That's kind of a pretty glaze, but 
It's not Sarah's quality, so. <laughs> uh, maybe, ooh, this is, is that black? No, this is Ruby. This might be Avon. It, it is Avon. What about this big one? Sarah did that one as well. Okay. It's a swan, and it's iridescent for a dollar. But it's a big one. I like it. What does Barb think? I thought you might like it. <laughs> I thought you might like that trash swan. Would, I think people would <laughs> like it. I just don't like swans. That's I'm getting mean. into them like no other. They can keep their flowers and their debris. I will take the salon by Sarah Smith. <laughs> That's your name. I think you're gonna have to take stuff up to the front. Yeah, I have to go deposit my materials because I am out of hands. So I am gonna get these little guys because they're a dollar each. Home interiors, little home co figurines. Great for like a fairy garden, of course. You're gonna have a whole block of them. I know, my gosh. <laughs> okay, well, are you going to ask about your baby? Are you just going to set it here? Are you going to carry it around all day? I'll carry it around. Okay. I want to look at the Christmas stuff. Okay, well, we'll go back to the dollar <laughs> section in a bit, but we're going to... Oh, that's a, oh, yeah, that's a strawberry. For $3, I'm going to get this. That's this just like the other one you got. Oh, Sarah. Oh, She's yeah. all over the place making things. So... Oh, I like this Jeanette. I think it's Jeanette. This is Frosted Swan Dish. Oh, it has a chip on the side. I wouldn't mind having just one of these, but not, I don't want to deal with it. This them, is Sterling think. Restaurant Wear. Is it? It's Semper Fidel. What does that mean again? I don't know. Does it mean seize the day? Doesn't mean fidelity, I don't think. <laughs> Fidelis. Semper Fidelis. So there's two of them. Huh. I don't know about that. I wonder what to think of such a thing. I can't it's, think it's for you, It's probably Barb. not super old. My guess would be maybe the 70s. I mean, it could be the 60s or something, but. Maybe the 70s. Yeah. Like mid 70s. I don't know. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. unsure as well. Look at that face. Only well. a mother could love it. <laughs> so this is by who? Looks like it says weenie. Let me see. W E E. W E E. I can't tell what else it says after that. How much is this little thing? Three dollars. I'm gonna get it. <laughs> so look at that thing. It's the Picasso. Yeah. It's the Picasso of cups. I guess it is. It doesn't say Mexico, does it? No, it doesn't say Mexico. Either way. I don't um, know if I want this. Well, nobody's twisting your arm. I know. <laughs> Do you want it for a dollar? Well. You say, I will give you 50 cents. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I get nervous that when it's one I haven't seen, like, that it'll be, like, you know, I'll um, think about it honestly, then. Honestly, I bet they've looked it up if you think. Hmm. I don't think it's going to be worth a ton. You just have to like it if you like it. I'll think about it. Or we'll think about it. I'm going to go deposit my items again. I'm handless. <laughs> well, look at the Corel and the Butterfly Gold. That's a fun one. So they got all of this, this whole stock for $4. I love Corel, you know that. So we've got that one, actually, and there's this other one. I don't know the name of this one offhand. I'm not sure if it's something to do with, I don't know. And nothing's coming to mind right now except, like, morning blue or something. I don't know. But... So, oh, look at this rooster. It's pretty. What's the bottom say? That's McCoy. Um, I'm not sure if it's like a newer McCoy or, but it's made to look like an old water pitcher and bowl. Cute for $4. Um, and these caught my eye. It's a really pretty, like kind of like a porcelain. And they're of these fish, but this fin has been broken off and reattached. You can see it right there. So that's a shame. I wish it wasn't. And look at all the Spice of Life canisters. That's a lot of them there. Um, so I am tempted. Let's see, this whole stack's four dollars. This one I like because it's the plates, the it's the dinner plates, lunch plates, and the dinner and the in the bowls. Yes. Four dollars. I think I'm gonna just do this one. All the mugs. I like the mugs. They're five dollars. 
Oh. Barb, do you want to buy the mugs? I don't know. Those are made by Pyrex or Corning, uh -huh. one of the two. Pyrex. But they're, well, they have Corning on it too, but they, so, but they go together, right? Yeah. They're like the same thing, you know? The, they made, so it would be Corel, Corning, and Pyrex all made very similar. They, they like work together. Right. But Corning, I think, is the parent company to Pyrex. Okay. I don't know how much such mugs would sell for, for like, say, a set of two or four. I, I mean, think they sell for about $3 each. Okay. So you're looking at... Wait a minute. Are they five for all? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight times three is 24. Yeah. Minus five. So you're at about a $20 profit on all. Hmm. Well, I don't know. That's up to you, Barb. I'm less inclined myself. Okay. You think the plates and everything would, would do better? I mean... Than mugs. I'm just not... I, don't, I usually don't deal with that, those, but... Yeah. For some reason, I just kind of wanted one for myself, but no. I think I'm there's some more odds and end ones over in the, the dollar... Uh, the, the, the three for a dollar glass section, too. There's a glass cloche. Some people like those cloches. They can do some crafty things with them. Okay, so I got my Corel plates. And I am not going to get the Semper Fidelis. It's the Marine Corps. Uh -huh. And I looked it up, and they don't seem to sell for a lot. Uh -huh. And I don't personally need it for my What's collection. What's the back of your baby say? It says uh, E, maybe I, H. Does that oh. say Company Inc.? Uh-huh. So hopefully that's good. Hopefully so. <laughs> I think somebody like painted it though, don't you? Are you a painted baby? Yeah, could be. I don't know. They wanted to help it out. Hmm. It's been dropped on the head too. <laughs> I'm gonna get this awesome tree skirt. It is only four dollars. So I think that's a pretty good price for the Actually, it's, I was going to say, I thought it was less than that. It's marked twice. There we go. It's $3 now. <laughs> They're crocheted tree skirts. So I think it's awesome. So I'm going to get that. And um, I think we're about done here. All right. That was actually really successful. I got a lot of interesting things. I'm trying to make sure I didn't add anything off camera. I don't think I did. I think I showed everything that I got, which was a pretty good amount of stuff for here. And so um, I think I did pretty well. And then Barb got her doll, and the lady, the lady that checks us out, she was like, she's, she's like, it's a creepy doll. Yeah, I guess it is sort of creepy. Yeah, I mean, especially since his head has been like broken open, but and plastered, <laughs> or plastered in the head. Yeah. Uh, so that's awesome. And you got it for thir She got it for thirteen. She yeah. took a couple dollars off. I don't know anything about dolls, so that might have been well. But then again, if you're try to, gonna try to find something like this on eBay, you'd have to pay shipping. But... I think that you got a decent deal for that. Okay. I, it's an old one. Yeah. I think it's very nice. Yes. But f for now, <laughs> <laughs> but she, she started over there and then she came this way. Oh, that's her car. Okay. <laughs> so for now, I'm going to wrap up this video. So thanks for watching and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't planned. <laughs>